Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla TV, where you can watch, decide, and ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of a very important product new from Dionese. This is called the Terran Jacket and Pant Combo, available at Revzilla.com. Now to my left, I have Jason standing in here with Dionese's new four-season flagship adventure touring outfit. This is called the Terran, Terran jacket, Terran pant. I have Jason wearing a 50 jacket, wearing a 50 pant. He's athletic build, 5'10", 175. 40 inch chest, no surprises. And the pants are nice because there's no short and long sizes, but there's an amazing amount of knee armor adjustability. So keep that in mind when you're looking at this jacket and pant combo. If we look at it though, taking a big step back, thinking a thousand feet here, a lot of times we've seen Europe produce a lot of garments that are three season cold weather. You'll have D-Dry, which is a waterproof breathable membrane. You have Gore-Tex, which is a better waterproof breathable membrane and some thermal. But a lot of times you're not really geared up for a lot of venting that's gonna give you that great summertime performance. From Dionese, this is the first time they've, we've really seen them nail it. So we have the Terran here. Jason's wearing the, the light silver and blue color. There's also a black. There might be some other trims to come as well. But really the key to this jacket and what you need to know, durable exterior, Inside, you have D-Dry, waterproof, breathable liner. Interior of that, you're going to have a thermal liner that's removable. Same thing on the pants. But the beauty is, with all the liners out, when it's sticky hot in the middle of July, now you can go to your mega vent panel system here. So on the front, as well as on the back, and I'll show you that in a second, as well as I'm actually going to come down here really quickly and do the pant, but now you have the ability to really flow a great deal of air directly to the body through these big vent panels. And you can see that they also double as pockets and you get your hand in behind there. I'm actually gonna show you on this left side here. And what happens is you have this big mesh panel that leads directly to the body. So what they did just from a style standpoint, and keep this in mind, is that this part, of they wanted it to look the same. So this is mesh that goes all the way down, but really the vent is this square from there up. So it's a direct vent from there up. Jason, turn backwards really, really quickly for me. I'm sure I'm gonna have you spin again in this video. But if we show on the well here on the back, you also have a huge panel on the back of the jacket that from here to here, it's complete direct ventilation. This is something that Dionese has never done before. And really, in my opinion, outside of the fact that this jacket has a really gnarly, rugged look and level of performance, it's the venting coupled with the waterproof, coupled with the thermal, that gives it true four season functionality. So come back around to the front. Let's kind of reel back in and start to hit some of the nuances here. So we've talked about sizing. There's a lot going on here. Let's start with exterior. The entire suit, jacket and pant, is going to be Comfort Cordura. So it's Cordura, which means it's strong, Comfort, which means it has a straight, slight stretch to it. And really, you see that same fabric throughout, except in certain areas where you're using mesh or different things. Moving into the shoulders, I know they're popping right out to you. These are thermoformed shoulders, so it's an additional level of abrasion resistance on top of your CE-rated Dionese armor. You also have that CE-rated armor shoulder air elbow and forearm, but you have this now big shock absorbing, abrasion resistant thermoform piece which sits on a layer of again, Comfort Cordura. So it's not going anywhere, but it's, it's also very comfortable. Moving down from there, you're gonna notice we have adjustment here on the biceps. You get to that through the, the panels. There's actually a bungee inside this pocket. I can pull it out here and show you when I pull it, it's gonna cinch down this arm panel. So again, not using a strap, using this bungee system. Moving down the arm, you can see the different fabrics or different colors come together, but again, it's all Comfort Cordura. Moving into the cuff, you do have a mat pocket on both sides, and it's cool that they did it on both sides. We're not sure why you need two of them. Maybe you can be Jason on this side, and when the cop asks you, you can be Batman on that side, and you're good to go. Moving into the cuff now. Basic wrist, double snap, it's kind of a set it and forget it. And notice here that on his left wrist, I have him using the built-in gaiter, that for the colder times of the year, you can get that good wind blocking from going up your sleeve. But in the warmer times of the year, all you have to do, there's two holes, there's the big hole and the small hole, not you put your whole hand through the non-thumb hole, and you're good to go and you don't even feel it. And it's actually soft so it doesn't get in the way. And you can see on the interior here, you can see that it's, I'm kind of using my other liners as well. Now if we look at it, I also have waterproof pockets down here 
on the front. These are waterproof. They're external stow pockets, cargo pockets on the outside. And another key feature here on the front, besides the fact that we have these rubberized zippers so they won't scratch your tank, is the way the collar is done. You know, we've had some internal debate here. We've talked about, you know, the best of what we've seen. We've seen some, in, some nicely engineered collars from other guys over time. But what Dionese is using here on the turn, they're a dual adjustable collar. So instead of having the collar cinch in the front and automatically have one side pulling the other side tight and getting that cinch that looks like that, by having both sides, you now have the ability to evenly create tension around the collar without misaligning the neck. We actually really like that as well. Again, a really, a nice forward thinking, a nice forward thinking element here on the jacket. Turn the face away from me, Jason. Embossed Dionese logo on the side, underneath the thermal from shoulder, big accordion flesh panel or stretch panel with soft inserts on the elbow. Moving Jason's arm up, we're seeing the new style waist adjusters from Dionese. What they're doing is they're sewing the excess on and to tighten it, you just pull on, you pull on the front side of it and it just slides down to loosen it. You pull on the back tab, it's very easy, opens right up. Again, just a nice touch. Water bottle pockets, again, it looks cool, but it's functional. Turn backwards for me, Jace. And you can see the way the top starts to shape up now. We talked about this collar that's fully adjustable back to front. And as we break it down, I'm going to kind of show you how quickly and easily the back panel goes back up. What you do is there's a snap when it's down, no snap when it's up. So think about it. If you're, if you're riding, like doing a, a mountain ride in Colorado and you're summiting and you need to close your vents, you're going to get hit with rain and you come back down to the lowlands and it immediately is 80 degrees. The ability to do that really quickly and take this guy from four season vent mode into at least wind blocking mode, it's a nice touch. Scotch light across the back for great amount, a great amount of reflectivity. And you do have a rabbit pouch. It does have a nice burly zipper on here as well. Jacket and pants do zip together. Come back around for me, Jason. Let's, let's break into the guts here a little bit. So as I snap Jason down, you're going to see Napoleon pocket, big zipper pull, meaning that Dionese does this on any jacket that's cold weather oriented. So it's got a four season component. We're going to give you a bigger rubberized zipper pull. It's the premium zipper pull, so you can find it with a beefy pair of gloves. Notice at the bottom too how the zipper stops. That gives you the ability to break this at the bottom. And say you're riding on a 12GS, and you, depending on your build, if you want it to flare a little bit, you now have a zipper that doesn't go all the way down. You can break it at the bottom and let it flare out so it doesn't bunch on you. Again, that's, that is a trick of upright riders. It is something that those guys look for. This type of rider is going to look for a feature like that. Moving to the inside, we see that I still have the D-Dry destination layer done. And I'm going to show you what this looks like standalone, but the way that it's designed, it's finished in the, in the spirit of being able to wear it off the bike. So this is your waterproof breathability and your thermal zipped into that. Looking at the collar on the main jacket construction, we have that soft wicking material that's really nice and finished, going to go against your skin. And again, here is my destination layer. And as I start to break this bad boy down, now I'm breaking down my, my waterproof. Notice spring-loaded snaps, another glovable, beefy jacket pull with another Napoleon pocket. Remember, it's that destination layer, You're getting that extra functionality. And as we break it open, now I can show you, whoops, and your collar was flipped down there. There you go, Jace. Thermal lining. Really nicely finished. Again, thermal collar, more wicking material, more comfort, and it's a snap system. There's my thermal liner. So you, you have the thermal liner to remove. You have your waterproof, breathable D-Dry liner, which has its own zip panel to zip to the pants. That's removable. And then from there, you have your YKK zip that comes off here. And now I'm in full-scale hot weather riding mode, just a nice, interior sanitized lining from Dionese that's going to give you the maximum airflow outside to in. So now that I have ja Jason out of the Terran jacket, let's roll through the Terran pants. Lots of similar functionality and remember, no tall and short sizes. I already mentioned the, the knees are very adjustable, which is nice. But looking at it, if you come up here towards the waist, you're going to see we do have suspenders. If you don't like suspenders, they're completely removable. Some guys love them. Also note here at the main connection, it's a slide, not a zipper. The interior of the waistband is going to be that same collar material that's nice and comfortable, that also wicks. And then Jason, as you come down here, you're going to sh I'm going to show you here, you can show it on this side, point to it with your hand there. You're going to have the adjustability that there's a built-in belt. So no belt loops here. You have the Velcro adjustability already built in. And you can see our 360 degree zipper so we can connect it to the pants. Now from a mesh standpoint, we have two mega vents down here on top of the thigh. And then we also, if you pull that pocket open and look in there, you're also going to have that big mesh panel that's inside of the pocket. So again, airflow through the pocket moving down. You access the knees from inside the pant. Turn away from me, Jason. 
Comfort Cordura here in the pants, reflectivity down the side, accordion stretch panel, getting down to the cuff, basic cuff design. I, don't, I think these pants are built in an ergonomic attack position, kind of for more aggressive dual sporting. So I don't want to go out on a limb and say it's going to be easy to get your pants over your boots with these on. I don't think they're set up that way. And notice here's my waterproof D-dry liner that goes all the way down. Moving back to the pants, turn backwards for me, Jason. More comfort cordura, you see the way the colors come together, you see the way they're articulated so it's gonna move with your body. And remember, the pants are waterproof, the pants have the thermal, the ability to break them down and go full four season as well. And look at this yoke here on the back. Here's your Dionese suspenders connection, and again, it's completely removable. And notice that you have a nice high waist on these pants as well. So now that I have the Terran off of Jason, I have it laid out here on the table. Jacket and pant, obviously. Hopefully you're not confused about that part. If we look at it, I want to break these down, show you the armor. We'll talk about some of the nuances of the guts that are really hard to show when we have it on our guy. So let's open up the Terran jacket first. Sorry, Terran jacket pants. Your second fiddle today. Opening up the jacket, thermal liner we talked about, full sleeve. It snaps into this destination liner. Again, the thing with the Terran, and we always, oh, we didn't do the left side yet. Gonna unsnap it and put it back in. The thing that you have to realize is that the flexibility factor is here is what key. That's the, that's, that's the big selling point of the Terran outfit. Dionese has been making tech stuff for a long time, but they haven't, in my opinion to date, other than their mess stuff, done that multi-season adventure, multi-season touring, you know, covering into the summer months. A lot of times, because they're a European company, they focus on the cold weather rider, which is typically the European market. So one, two, three. I love the thermals that do a snap, because again, it's, it's gonna get, you're gonna wanna just pop it out quickly. Snap up here at the collar. And then I'm going to reach down here and unhook really quickly. Should be able to unhook this bad boy. See how good I am here today. I already did the left side. Aha, magic. Pull that guy out. Notice here's my thermal, nice thermal at the collar, wicking very soft, no issues there. Here's my D-dry liner. 360 degree zipper can be connected to the pants directly. Full scale waterproof, breathable, also destination layer. Great looking. And remember, it's got the big the big pulls for big gloves. Again, a gnarly jacket. Zip on the inside of the left. I believe my left cuff is finished. It is. Here's my left cuff. And then I'm going to go over here to the right, pull it out and show you. It is, whoops, it's got to get pulled out through this gator. Single snap. So single snap inside of there. I love that it's not a dual snap. It keeps you from getting them twisted. Single snap's good enough, good enough for me. Here's my zip on this side, pull, snap done, open. Here's my destination layer. Remember, it's styled and solid enough to be worn off the bike. They did you a mitzvah there. It's a great looking jacket that'll work really well. Now, pulling out my armor. Here's my anatomic, anatomically correct left shoulder. Elbows are removable as well, but again, it's the CE rated Dionese armor that you can pull out. And again, this bad boy on the inside is going to have mesh lining, comfort at the collar, nice style, a good amount of flexibility in pockets, cinches down here. It'll take two different back protectors. There's two pockets here. Pocket for a wave, pocket for a shield. Dionese just started doing this. And for the guys' jackets, it's always a G2. Wave G1, or wave G2, shield G2. But again, you have the ability to have some flexibility to temp depending on the shape of what you want or what you might already own. There are a lot of guys that ride multiple disciplines that might already own a Dionese back protector. Nice to have that flexibility. All right, Taryn, goodbye. Now we're going to move into the pants. Same kind of deal. Thermal lining on the pants. Notice it's a slide, not a snap. Slides are great. Slides keep you buttoned in even after a full meal. Slide, it also has a button on the inside. The entire top waistband is the same material that we see at the collar. And I know you're all wondering how easy is it to get the suspenders off because I don't dig suspenders when I ride. Some people love them, some don't. It's a personal preference thing. Pop them off on the front. Snap here. That snap gives way, it slides right through. And there you go, my suspenders are off. But notice the yoke even has 3D mesh on the back that's gonna wick sweat. Moving into the pan itself. Now remember, it's a two-liner system. I have my thermal. Right, so you're getting that four seasons, so you need a little more flexibility. A little more flexibility means a little bit more functionality on the inside, and that's okay. So I'm gonna pull that out, 
Here's my thermal. I'm not sure if my thermals are connected. They are not. There was a snap down at the bottom of each pants, but it is a snap. It was easy enough to do. I just did it so I could pull them out quickly. There's my thermal, again, warm. And now here's my D-Dry, the black. Not a base layer here for the pants that's meant to be worn as destination. You really wouldn't wear this standalone. But notice it even has, even has some elasticity across the crotch. I'm gonna zip it around. Again, I like circumferential zippers. I think they provide the best connection points, even though they take a hair more time than some other options there. Oh, I disconnected this one down at the bottom of the pants. Notice single snap as well, easy to find. Ah, and I did it on both sides, good. So I pull this guy out. Here's my waterproof breathable layer. Notice that again, just like the jacket, it's not finished. It's, it's not meant to be worn on its own. And then once you break in here, basic mesh interior, this is summer weight riding. We have pro shape armor, which is an F1 style CE armor that's new from Dionese that lives, it's very soft, it's comfortable in the hips. And the last thing I want to show you is actually two more things. I'll show you the bottom inside of the cuff here. So here's my bottom inside of the cuff. Normally on a pant, this is how you get to the knee armor. But on the new style Dionese adjustable knees, you go in through the top. So what you do is when you get these pants, when you buy them from us, you're going to get them. You're going to want to, it's going to take you a couple tries probably because you have to get into them from this way. But once you sit on your bike, get in that riding position, make sure the knee armor is in the correct spot. To tune it, you're opening up this pocket. And what there is, is there's a female, there's a piece of female Velcro that goes all the way down. And it has a really great range. I mean, you're talking three, four, five inches here. And when I pull it out, you're going to see, here's my knee armor, right? CE proof. Here are these female, this almost clamp these wings and you have this panel of female Velcro that sits inside. So basically, if this is the panel of female Velcro, you're moving the armor on this Velcro up and down so you get it in the right spot, and then you're done with it. You never have to worry about it again. But the nice part is that even though it might have looked like something that was difficult, it's not. You're going to feel when it's in the right place. But when you take the time to do it right, you're the best chance, it's the best chance you have to be really covered in the, in the case of a get-off to make sure your armor's in the right place. So I threw a lot at you at the Terran. Four season. Top end, D-dry, waterproof breathable, thermal component, will breathe with the mesh panels in the summertime. Again, thank you Dionese for listening and taking steps forward and bringing your beautiful styling into more multi-season summer weight adventure and multi-season touring. I would love to hear your feedback on the Terran. On our YouTube channel, in the comments, comments, questions, opinion, I'd love to hear it at first glance. Remember there's a black version as well or on the site on our product detail page. Remember, you can always subscribe to us at Revzilla TV as well on our YouTube channel. Click here, stay up to date with all the latest gears, reviews that we're constantly rolling out. And past that, if you want to talk geek, if you want to talk about product sizing and whatnot, shoot us a line, see us at Revzilla.com or 877-792-9455. As always, over 30 bucks. We'll ship for free, exchange for free, no restock fee if you need to send it back to us. And you can always earn teams of the cash to be applied to your next order by continuing to shop with us. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. The Dionese Terran jacket, Terran pants, they're D-dry, waterproof, breathable. Find them at revzilla.com slash Dionese. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.